Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man X. So, now that we've taken out one of these masters, or mavericks, we're going to go ahead and take on the one that I consider to be the correct choice in the progression of the game, which is Storm Eagle. I love this guy's stage. His music is so amazing. Too bad I can't hear it because of the way I'm recording. I get no game audio whatsoever, which is weird because it's like playing in a vacuum. Oh well, I'll survive, I guess. Um, uh, oh well, once you get to about these the top of the clouds, go ahead and do a dash jump off so you can get over here and pick up a heart container, or a heart tank, or whatever you want to call those things. They increase your maximum health by a few points, and it is incredibly helpful. And I will be showing off where all of those are, as well as every other power-up in the game, because I'm pretty sure I know where they're all at. By pretty sure, I mean entirely sure. And we want to kill this thing and ride the lift back up. I think all you have to do to make the world stand on it I also charge just in case. I don't think you have to. And we're going to move here and kill this guy. The thing we picked up at the top of that thing... Er, <laughs> the thing we picked up at the top of the thing, could they be more descriptive? No, at the top of that little area was a sub-tank, which are different from the E-tanks of the previous Mega Man games, because you can fill them up with energy as you're playing along. Now, what I like to do in this area is try and dash jump off the top of those. You know what? I'm gonna get this power up because you can generally make it to the next one, especially if you wait until they're going down, because, well, uh, the, there's space, so one's, well, one is going up, two is going down, but three is also going up with one, and if you jump as one is going down and two is going up, three is also going down, but you're starting from a higher position, so you should be able to land on three while getting past two. These tanks are annoying, all you have to do is keep shooting them, they'll blow up, and here is our next upgrade to our equipment. So, here we will pick up a helmet and get to go Mario on some blocks, which is kind of cool, but is generally useless, you only use it in a few stages, but whatever. It allows us to get the next upgrade, which is awesome. Well, you actually only have to pick it up then. Look, we Mario Mega Man! Mega Mario? Hmm. Maybe Mega Marie. Oh, someone's gonna enjoy that reference. And someone's bugging me to play that game. I might do it eventually. It really depends on the recording setup I can get up for games that are executable. Because, wow, I need to stop walking into things like a moron. It's a little different to record a game like this, because I have a recording option and the thing I'm playing it from. Whereas if I were to try to record something like Mega Marie, it wouldn't work nearly as well, because I'd have to go back to using Cam Studio like it did in Zelda 1, and then I suffer audio desync and the video kind of looks crappy, although I think I have a plan to get around that. We'll see. It really depends on what you, the fans, want. Because I want to play games that will make you guys happy. Now, Storm Eagle here has one of those points of defense I'm, I was talking about, where if you, whoa, only use a second charge shot, it's only going to do one point of damage to him. Now, when he's doing this dive attack, you can usually get a full charge in and hit him with, you know, your full power for two points. But Generally, the best thing to do is just dash out. Look how much damage I'm doing per shot. That's crazy. Much better than you can do with that. Almost as good as that, I think. Not the same. Come on. Yes! Finisher! Well, that was... I guess that wasn't that quick. It didn't feel like it took very long, though. So, that is our second Maverick done out of the way, and we're completely finished with his stage. We won't have to go back because we picked up all the power-ups. I haven't mentioned it yet, but I probably should now. In every stage, there is a heart tank. So, there are eight in the game, we picked up one, we didn't get the one chill penguin stage because we couldn't. And, we have uh, Storm Eagle's new awesome weapon, the Tornado Doom, which is great against this guy. 
Hmm, let's see, have I got enough time for one more fight? Uh, I hope so. So, we're gonna go ahead and jump right into the Clean Mammoth stage. Now, what I intend to do is show off tactics to fight all the bosses using just the X-Buster, which might be a little difficult for certain bosses. Uh, Cutman Remake, if anyone knows what I'm saying or talking about. Yeah, that guy's kind of a jerk. Oh, come on, don't get hit by things and don't waste time. We're on a YouTube time limit here. So, the hardest thing in this stage is making that jump. You need to get up to there and not fall down! Crap! Oh, that is where the awesome power-up was. I'll pick it up later. You know what? While I'm in here, I'm going to show off the nifty new weapon we got. I know, I guess I'll show off the ice weapon since I haven't yet. But I like using this on these guys. Because it blows them away. Ha 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 ha. That wasn't an intentional pun. <laughs> no, it really wasn't intentional. I didn't mean to say blow away when using a wind attack. Oh well. Here's our second sub tank. See, this stage is the perfect one to do next. The problem with it is that I messed up getting that power up. Oh, oh well, I'll just redo it. Whoa, don't hit me with a pickaxe. Well, he didn't. He almost did. And that would have hurt. Okay, jump up here. Oh, I love the tornado! Look at all the uh, havoc it's wrecking. And I suppose I can start using this to show it off a little bit. Ow. But you see, it's kinda cool. Because I can shoot it off a wall and hit this guy. Yeah. But, meh. It's not powerful enough to really use. So, here we are heading into Flame Mammoth's little arena. Which is actually different than the rest of them. He's fighting us on a conveyor belt, which is problematic, I guess, sort of. Yeah! Whoa, how did I do that? <laughs> did you see that? I had a charge shot ready, and yet I shot a uh, little weak normal attack. Hmm, weird. But yeah, the real uh, strategy you have against this guy is don't be on the ground when he lands because that will stun you, and just try and stay away from him and on the wall, Ooh, and don't jump into him when he's jumping at you. Now, I like to shoot from the wall because, you know, it automatically makes you shoot in the other direction, that wants to play, which is awesome. Ha! In the face. And there's one other thing you can do with this guy, other than, uh, you know, shoot him with the X Buster or use his weakness, which is the tornado. If you use a certain cutting weapon, you can cut off his trunk. Which is kind of cool. I guess I'll show that off some other time. But, there we go. Hmm. Let's see if I can't rush back in here and pick up that power-up since I missed it. Like a moron! But first, we have to pick up our weapon. We get Fire Wave! Which is a short-range flamethrower-type attack. It is really powerful, but really not practical. And it allows us to go get something from Chill Penguin stage, which I'll probably be doing some other time, because I want to try and pick up that power-up I missed, because it's far more important than anything else. Come on, go, 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 go! Faster, damn you! There we are. Down the hole, and... <sighs> if I mess this up too many times, I'm probably just going to cut to my success. Oh, come on. This is not really that difficult a jump. It's only pixel perfect. Come on, mash the act. <laughs> See you guys in a bit. Okay, I'm back. <clears throat> Let's try this again. Miss. Fail. Got it. And good, 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 good. That only took one extra take. Sweet. Here we get our new power-up. This capsule is going to increase our ability to shoot things. Yay! Better shooting of stuff. It's awesome. Ha 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 
too bad when we jump in it takes forever because it has to power up our weapon and then we have to charge up our weapon to demonstrate its usefulness. The same way we demonstrate all of our new powers, usefulness, this, 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 this. See, look at that, boom. All the way up to the fourth charge with the little backlash hits people that are behind us. Anyway, that's all the time I have for today. It's Classic Homer signing out. Everybody have a good night.